Good news, my lovely, wonderful people. It is patience, good luck, Billy Jonathan's wife's birthday. 59. Hmm, I didn't know she was that young. Of course. I mean, this Naduma when he tell us, see, we see. Um, not only you take leg waka come, not only you take leg waka come. You know, she's just a sense of a good sense of humor. I can assure you for free. You know, so this is the woman, um, you know, one of the persons who supported Yeso Wiki, you know, for him to become governor. And, um, you know, she and her husband. And recently, our very own brother, you know, uh, has been has been on, you know, has been talking to Wiki with regards to his attitude to Fubara. And on the occasion of her birthday, Fubara went to celebrate with patience, Jonathan, and she made a pledge to him. He said, don't worry, don't worry. I promise to stand with you and by you. We put the talk now, political big way to a hell. You should guy was just matter what if you do, not worry yourself. Oh, we have money talks. <laughs> you see, I so now just 59 years old. You might all do things. Eh? <laughs> you know, patience, Jonathan. Now <laughs> there is God, oh God, oh God, oh God. Now she, now she, now she, man, oh, pass her, man, oh, pass like that. Anyway, she don't pledge to support her uh, for against Wiki, no matter what thing happen. Please don't forget to give us a thumbs up like or share subscribe don't disturb yourself at all i will stand with you and for you good luck Billy jonathan's wife patience jonathan promises fubara as fubara declares an undespeakable a woman of peace a woman worthy to be celebrated at 59. you have not only showed such enviable lifestyle but have continued to demonstrate strong commitment to various political social cases. The River State Governor Sim Fubara has felicitated with the former Nigerian First Lady, Mrs. Patience Good Luck Billy Jonathan, on her 59th birthday on Friday, October the 25th, 2024. In a congratulatory message in Port Harcourt, Governor Sim Fubara described Good Luck Billy Jonathan, Patience Good Luck Billy Jonathan, as a woman of peace a distinguished and patriotic Nigerian whose life has been a pillar of support, source of love, strength and blessing to loved ones and others far and wide. He said, I, on behalf of the government and good people of River State, extend our heartfelt felicitation to you, Your Excellency. Patience, good luck, Jonathan. Patience, good luck, Jonathan. On this occasion of your 59th birthday, you are indisputable, a woman of peace, leadership, wisdom, benevolence, unwavering, dedicated to public service. Over the years, you have not only shown such enviable lifestyle, but have continued to demonstrate strong commitment to various political social classes particularly in agriculture, women empowerment, education, healthcare, philanthropists in rivers, state across the Nigerian and a continue and continuously all across the world, leading a leading mark in our sands of time, leading through democracy. We join you to celebrate. Good luck, Ibele Jonathan Patience in return says, Sim Fubara, you are a true dedicated son. I will stand with you and for you. Don't worry yourself. All those who are pursuing you will fall for your sake. I am with you. I will stand with you. She pledges to support Sim Fubara. As many says, this is just the tip of the iceberg. It's another, you know, it's another pledge, it's another commitment, you know, from a patient's Jonathan's hand to support Sim Fubara against Yesom Wiki. We all know that Yesom Wiki has been, you know, a serious uh, man who has not allowed Sim Fubara to drink water put cup for grand because he mean Fubara not be smart and say we say he go show Fubara say we say na him be chemo. We call him watch it. He say really say yes so he say go show Fubara say in a chemo, you know, you know, and uh, you go surprise, okay? Uh, which which they go on here and everybody just they watch him. Well, good luck, Billy Jonathan. Uh, patience, wife, say, uh, patience, he say, go support him no matter what he happens, say, they with him. So, when you look at the whole political fight going on in River State, 
you will wonder to yourself if really and sincerely truly there is any form or iota of uh, truth in all of this going on because um with everything happening everybody can tell that you know it is no longer business as usual as you and i can see that you know uh fubara everybody knows he's been oppressed not to say fubara is a saint who was in this occasion he's been oppressed okay by yeson wiki who is the minister but we not want the person who is in charge now to be in charge because he feels that the person is not good enough or he wants to micro manage <clears throat> all that is going on these are part of the real serious you know uh, issues that are on ground and everybody can see and is wondering you know how did we get here at the moment okay so it is important that we do not uh, you know allow these same things over and over again to keep us you know in one point if we must move we must move now and ensure that we put you know the right persons the right things in place so as a nation nigeria we can move forward there are lots of things that are going on right now and everyone must understand it that nigerians who cannot continue with the same thing over and over again then expect a different result good luck a uh, patience uh, jonathan has promised to support fubara but is that enough is that enough is, is that because the truth of it is these politicians they know how they play their game every one of us just sit down you know we just sit down and we are watching and um, the truth of it is so people say it's not my business and let them keep fighting themselves whatever happened will also affect you and that's why nobody can just fool the answer and say it's not my business let them keep fighting you can't say that no because when they finish with fighting themselves they will come for you and that's why you cannot afford to fold your arms and say oh it's not my business no you can't do that so you can see the dilemma that we are in and why truly and sincerely again every single individual has got a part to play speaking out is one of them ensuring that the same thing that has been keeping us in the dark do not continue some nigerians have sincerely truly risked their life for this country to get to where it is today but others take advantage of the hard work of some people and you know and just put the nation in, in jeopardy things must change and we must do everything humanly speaking possible to ensure that this change come in whatever way you know we can we can we can ensure that we, we put things together it is now more than ever before please don't forget to give us a thumbs up like us share subscribe click on the notification button so you can get all our latest news god bless have a lovely and a fantastic day bye for now